okay, this is fine in the corner too. I haven't made a video in a long time, but I decided to make a video today of my Central Texas Arrowhead hunting finds. I think this is number four. And first I'm going to go, well first I'm going to show you the finds that I got from my deer lease first. Then I'm going to show you finds from Fredericksburg, Texas. I went down there for the Arrowhead show, which is pretty long drive. And I found some stuff there, not as much as the deer lease though. I'm going to show you the first of the pieces of points I found at the deer lease. Here's the only whole one. The lighting is a little bad. But it's a part analysis and it's re been resharpened on the blunt or to a blunt. And it's white and a little bit of root beer flint in the corner. That's a good one. Here, I don't know what type this is, but it is very. It's got a real good patina on it, like right in there it's root beer flint. I don't know what kind it is, but it's got a busted tip, resharpening the edges and everything else. Um, And here's the smallest one I found. I don't know what type that is either, but it's real black flint that I've never found there. The thinnest arrowhead I've ever seen. I don't know if you, the camera's not very good, but... It's paper thin or less, I would say. Probably broken there making it. That was a creek find. So were the other two. It would have been cool finding that hole. Um, another one is part of a real big knife. Well, I'm saying it was real big, but probably it was. Don't know for sure. But it's rounded off at the bottom. Never really have found whole tools except choppers for some reason. Another root beer flint, half of a blade or a piece of a blade. Middle piece of a root beer flint blade. Or a bottom or a top piece, whatever. Um, I forgot what kind of, but they're, what kind of arrowhead or whatever these are, but they're real big knives and this is the base. It's got a little, I forgot what they're called, but I've seen them before. It's broken though. Um, this is almost a twin to the other one I found on my other video, like right there, but they don't match at all. They're just made of the same tip material, almost the same way. Broken blade. Here's a scraper, chopper thing. Fun hundreds of those, or some of them don't even pick up. Um, another chopper. This one's a little bit better made. Most of them just pretty much common hand tools. Oh, here's another bottom half of a blade. I found two of those. Here's a weird looking flint. I never found it. Chopper. Or whatever you want to call it. Um, another crude one. Looks like he's been in a fire or something. Chopper. And this is probably the best, the best like hand chopper or axe preform, whatever you want to call it. Brown patina on it. It's not broken. It just ends like that. pretty big and found a knife looks like it's been in the fire for a little bit it's pretty weird and this is a real nice made well chopper or axe whatever you want to call it hand axe it's made in weird some weird looking flint and here is the Fredericksburg, Texas finds. Some Cortex knife. It's got a bunch of Cortex on it. And 
I swear to man. Another half of a knife. Base of a big knife or scraper or whatever. I I don't know if this is a preform axe head or what, but it's one of the only whole tools I found. I'm gonna just call it an axe head because that's what it looks like. Not for sure. And here's my first paleo find. Found it in Fredericksburg. Hold on, let me see if I can get a magnifier. Okay, I found them. The magnifier. Magnifying glass. It's a paleo point, but it looks like it's broke a long time ago and it went through a resharpening sometime. And I don't know what kind of arrowhead it is or paleo or whatever. Took it to the Fredericksburg show and some people said it was paleo, but I didn't even know. See if I can get a thing of the tip. Looks like it's broke when you look at it like that, but it's been resharpened to a blunt. It was probably pretty big, but it's root beer flint with a little creek white creek patina on it. Don't know what top it is or whatever. And Oh, I have one more that I forgot to show you from the deer lease. It's the biggest chopper I found there. It's got some nice, huge flakes taken off of it. It's perfect, like, shape for it to fit in the hand. And I think the last one is one I found right in the middle of the city in Corsicana. It's a, my first petrified wood find. It is a petrified wood little sc scraper. I don't know if there's a way to date these or whatever, but little. Never found anything in that creek, and then it rained, and I found this. You can kind of see the flakes on it. Not really any flint here, but a bunch of petrified wood. And I think that's it right now. Uh, stay tuned for more finds. Bye.